Well, how about that? Made it to John O'Groats, guys. Not bad for a short commuter. We have five minutes until the weather changes, so better get going. All right, guys, have a good trip. Bye. No, really, I've been so lucky when I got here two days ago because yesterday it was an absolute storm. It's so windy. It's going to rain all day. So I, I took the day off. I couldn't ride, which was good because the internet here is very slow. So it took me ages to upload the video. But today it's lovely again. Very lucky so far, very, very lucky. So I guess I'll be going further along the NC500 today. Feels good, feels good to be on EVE again. A viewer put that in my maps and said it would be a good idea for a photo. I don't really know why, but I did it for you, mate. They're way cooler. I bet you are already radiated. I'm quite aware of that. I also need energy for the motorcycle and the carbon footprint is also very high on producing the batteries and all this and, you know, and it's also a dirty business producing the batteries. So I'm quite aware of that. For me, it's just a different way of traveling. This motorcycle makes so many things more easier for me and it's much more convenient than you think. And I certainly don't travel on an electric motorcycle because I want to save the world. I don't know. I don't know if we even can. I'm an artist, not a scientist. I had all these locks for my bag, you know, these little TSA locks, you know, I had them, but... Yeah, that's more like it. I don't have the locks, but I believe in the people of Betty Hill to not steal anything. I wouldn't go that far, though. So loud! Cool, that wasn't a buggy. It's very busy inside. I guess that it's just how this winter coffee is really good. This coffee is really good. Couldn't really eat anything. I had a huge veggie breakfast and fish and chips yesterday. I really have to make better food decisions. I need to find an apple somewhere. Oh, there's, there's a chicken. That's normal. Okay. <laughs> yes, that's normal. <laughs> She hates lynx, but she's not gonna smell me anytime soon anyways. Uh, fruits. It's not their latest model, but... Who is it by? Uh, it's called... I just want to film your, your motorcycle. Oh, the old Gussie. Man. 1973. Cool bike. 1973. So between us, we have well over 110 years. Before I had this one, uh, I had a Honda Dominator. All right. Like uh, from '89. Uh, yeah. And I traveled all over. Like I was in Iceland with it. Uh, I did uh, Scandinavia yeah. tour like a few months back. Aye. And now I have this one.
And the gas station is uh, right over there. Must must be right. Cheers, man. <laughs> the old Guzzi. Beautiful bike. Guys, I'm telling you, I was chatting longer than I was charging. This happens every day. Every day. Gotta be honest, I love it. I love chatting about the motorcycle. If you have seen my interview with this German podcast, then you know I could chat about it for ages. Time to visit uh, Coco Mountain. Any bikers? <sighs> now I can fly my drone. That's a massive pig. Wow. Look at that. Wow. End of view. I think it would be wise to put on rain gear now. <laughs> I don't know why, but I always wait until the last minute. <sighs> and I have the feeling I will stop once I have it on. Isn't it always like that? I think it's all over there now. And I don't know. I swear there has been a rainbow just 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 over there. Oh it's gone now. It's still there, you just can't see it. Oh, well, just talked about eating healthy, man, that chocolate. This cocoa had so much chocolate in it that I had to get a, a water refill because it was on the bottom, it was only chocolate. It was so thick I couldn't even drink it, I would have to chew it. Phenomenal. There's even a charger here, you know, I thought, okay, maybe I'll put in a little bit. It gets you through the whole process. But then when you click start, I won't do it. I even called them just, you know, for scientific reasons. That was, it was kind of useless. It was right there. Anyway, the weather is way better now. That's quite the view, guys. Man, who would have thought, right, that you can get to places like this on a short commuter? Some say electric scooter. Just incredible. I'm happy I'm doing this on Eve here. Just fantastic. Fantastic roads. And it's just the start. It is just the beginning. We're starting 
the west route now. So you guys are in for a treat the next episode. Really gotta be careful though. Uh, the wind is brutal though. Headwind the whole day. Epic. <laughs> That's what you call epic. Wow. Wow. <laughs> First time I really have it down to zero range. I'm here anyways, I'm where I wanted to go anyways. I'm camping tonight, guys. It's about time, about time. I was living the high life for far too long. Oh shit, <laughs> we're now closed. <laughs> no, shit. Oh, but just the restroom, okay. Oh, yeah. Woo! Oh. They haven't got an adapter for me, but it doesn't matter. Their washing room has a power plug. I'll just plug her in there. So turn this up, let's charge Eve. That view is not so bad. I'll be off in my editing room so that you guys can watch the video tomorrow morning. Fingers crossed for good internet. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. See you tomorrow.